episode, um, we start right out with Kara waking up and, oh, hey, she's not actually awake. She's down and out for the count for most of the episode. Um, and we get our introduction, in, introduction, 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 <laughs> our introduction to the Legion of Superheroes. <sighs> okay. <laughs> so, How long have you been waiting to talk about this? How long ago did I post the pictures? God, I like just a week listen. Ish? Yeah. So <laughs> while we were on a break, uh, Bob here posted some pictures on our Instagram and probably Twitter and stuff like that. So um, we were posting those pictures as they were released of the Legion and the looks of the uniforms and the characters. Uh, let's just say that the character designs and the costumes were met with mixed reactions by both us and the fans. Um, so let's just get out into it. Let's just, let's just go for it. Let's start with the new character, Brainiac 5. Well, you guys should remember that I was really stoked for this character. <laughs> and and, and uh, yeah. tell me, how did you feel yeah. when you saw me post the picture? Because your pukey emoji said something. Yeah, sure did. <laughs> if you look at our Instagram, you can see my pukey face emoji. Um, that's about how I felt. I felt... Very, very disappointed and a little bit sick to my stomach. Um, no, I, I just, I don't know. They really did this character a disservice. They made, Bob said earlier, and I totally agree with him, they made an attractive guy look fucking ugly. Just really ugly. He's a good looking guy. Jesse Rath is is perfectly fine looking. And they managed to take that and turn it awful. Um, and now, before anyone tries to say, oh, well, it's the makeup, you know, that that sort of makeup doesn't necessarily make someone look good or blah, blah, blah. Well, Jesse Rath was in uh, Defiance as like an alien in that, I think. Um, if I if I pull up pictures, I haven't watched Defiance, but if I pull up pictures of him, what I see is a very pale kind of non-human-y looking skin tone with like violet contacts and white hair. Not super far off from what we've got going on with Brainiac 5, but so much better executed. It's like the wig itself doesn't look like crap and doesn't look fake. He has super light eyes, really light skin tone. He also, I mean, he almost looks vampiric. Um, And yet... Not Damn, I would ugly. Take, I would take him from Defiance. I just looked at the picture. I'm sorry. Right? See? Yeah. Yeah. It's, I, it's so much better. And it's not a very, it's not an entirely different look. You know what I mean? Like, they're, had they taken something like this and put those little, like, little doodads there on his forehead? That's a technical term for anyone yeah. that's not really <laughs> uh, well versed in science. Doodads is a very technical term for that. Yeah, um, they connect this stuff. They do. Yeah, they do things. I just like <laughs> I, you had options, guys. Why did you go with this one? Like both of you probably expected him to look relatively attractive, being that this was gonna be Supergirl's love interest. Yeah, I at least the rumored love interest. I rumored, expected yeah. him. Okay, so the the Brainiac Five that I know and that I am familiar with, Kara Smoochin, um. <laughs> looks a little bit like Beast Boy in a sense. You know what I mean? Like he looks like a regular guy. He just has green skin, but you know, he has blonde hair instead of, you know, Beast Boy. But And his hair is actually like styled. Yeah. Nice. Like a regular haircut, stuff yeah. like that. Like he looks like a looks like a regular dude. He's just <laughs> looks green. like a real boy, just green. I'm a real boy. <laughs> um Yeah. I'm really disappointed. So head to toe, it was disappointment for both of you. Yeah, yeah. and that wig looked like crap. It C looks like... CW, I thought we stepped up our game. No, they found the Oliver wig from oh, God. and put it on somebody else and <laughs> restyled it. So being that you guys it's are both kind of like into the costumes and stuff like that in like real life, do you look at <laughs> things like this and you're like, we could do this way better? Yeah. Um, in, a, in a sense, a yeah. Um, yeah. So his costume wasn't the problem. You know what I mean? Like that was well made, well tailored. Yeah. Um, the fabrics that they use, that's all good and well. I don't have an issue with that. It's that freaking fluffy wig and and the makeup and just why did you do that? The freakazoid hairstyle. Yeah. And like you know he's gonna have close ups on camera shot in high definition. 
why are you using those like powders and whatever to to create contours in his face with like purple and like some of it's kind of metallic and not, why did you do that? He looked like a fish. It looked like some Pinterest girls yeah. like mermaid makeup thing. Hashtag nailed it. <laughs> and let me let me pin cosmic girl makeup. Pin it. Like that's what it looked like. <laughs> Ugh. It looked like an amateur like beauty influencers like Halloween makeup YouTube video. The makeup everybody wants. But nobody really but don't. does. <laughs> it's just I come on, guys. Like we know your makeup artist can do better than that. Let's so let's do better. Or hire someone get, better. I don't get, know. Get rid of the wig. The wig is bad. Can Why get, did they can go through a haircut? That? Maybe he just didn't have time to get a haircut yet. Listen. Maybe I, they'll be like Jay Garrick. Remember when he first came, he had like that old guy haircut and flash, and then they made him pretty. I don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm just disappointed. And they like took away his eyebrows and stuff. Like what is going on? Why did you make the decisions you made? They turned him into this like Chrissy. And Brainiac 5 is normally kind of a stick in the mud about things. He's just like the one that's that says, guys, no, we shouldn't allow this person to see this or do that or whatever. Like that doesn't make any sense. Logically, we shouldn't do that. He is a little bit of a stick in the mud. That's fine. But he's usually not quite. I don't know. Like this. I'm a little, I'm a little disappointed, guys. 